Hello everybody, this is Sonia. Now, I'm um, coming to show you this book that I've completed except for the cover. <laughs> um, I didn't really have anything particular to do today, so I thought I'd just show you this, how, it, how it's worked out. Okay, so this is the journal we've been working in. Um, I don't know yet, the cover's going to be fabric for sure. And I'm thinking about um, some stitching, maybe some patchwork, something anyway like that. So we'll see. We'll see what I find. We'll see what happens, and and then I'll show you it when I'm putting it in my Etsy, which would probably be soon. I hope, but you don't know how things go. You know. <laughs> okay. So this is the first. This is the first page. Now I can't remember how many signatures it's got in it. This here bookmark's going to come with it because it's absolutely gorgeous. And I've pushed it down there. This has got um, some little writing space. Now, I do a lot of work in these books, but I also leave, also make little places for writing. Okay, so when I say I'm filling, I'm putting lots of stuff in, I do leave enough room for you to journal okay I do leave the room for you to journal so don't worry it won't be <laughs> it won't be um, just completely full of things because over here then there's also this part with two pages and there's that bit there so you see you've got a fair bit of journaling on these two spots here and there's a button on that okay now over this page there's a, another journaling space under here um, it's off a children's book so it's you can see through that, but that's okay. This is how these are made, these journals, aren't they? And there's a koala bear and a possum under there and a baby koala. And that's one of my belly beans I made for it. And there's lace on every page. Oh, maybe not. <laughs> well, th these smaller ones not. Um, there's a few dents in them in the work, but that's because I've put beads. There's a few dents in the little pages but that's because they've got beads and pretty things in it and I need to have the beads and the pretty things so there's a possum on there and he's got enough journaling space on him and there's also journaling space on this piece here which might have to have a little bit of a sticky on that I'll have to check him back later journaling here and there's a bookmark that I made not very um, technical or anything just a plain piece of um, ribbon it has got paper stuck to the back of it and it has a little pin just in case you want to pin it something else there's a patch on there because it was a tiny little tear and I don't like to have little tears so if there's any more little tears that I find before I've um, put it up I'll definitely have a patch on it flower that I made fun I do I love to do them things and there's a journaling space behind the little bunny rabbits and there is a journaling space behind here so we have lots of journaling space this one here's bare I can't believe that. <laughs> now in here I have a, I haven't even turned it into a booklet, but the reason being is because you can use that for something, anything you want to, you don't have to put it in the book, and that way you can put it on a different page or tear out a bit and stick it there or something. There of course will be um, embellishments to uh, go with this, so you'll be able to do a bit yourself if there's a space left. This one here's got a, um, Little turning around. Does it turn around? Turn around? Yeah. <laughs> I think it turns around. I don't know. I'm not going to. I'm going to fiddle with it. Um, journaling space behind that one. This is a little journal in here, and I have not put anything down the back of that one yet. Hang on a second. Here we go. Here's a tag for that. Blue is good. Will it fit in there? I could just cut the bottom off of that. I think and put it in. What do you reckon? I might have to cut the bottom off it so it'll go right down in there a bit better. And I made this little cluster of things. Isn't that cool? I do like those. I do like doing those. More spaces to journal. And then when you undo this, it'll open up to an envelope. I don't think there's anything in there. That'll be a surprise for you both, both me and you because I don't know. And then there's this page here, of course. There's this one here that um, I made and had to redo but I like the fact that it looks like it's been redone <laughs> and I don't know why I put that there but that's okay we're going to have that little lace I think it needed a bit of trim 
and I couldn't put it onto here. I thought about putting it on there. Then I know, I know what I was doing. I was going to put it over there, and then I couldn't because I wouldn't have been able to lift that up. So we had to come up with something anyway. So this is a nice piece of lace on there. And there's all this, this crochet lace is all mostly down the edges. So then I've got this piece here, which does not lift up anymore, which I probably should stick that down too. So I'll be coming back through here doing all that sort of thing. You don't have to worry. I will check it a few times before anything else. So there's another little one of those cluster things that I make and a spare page, another spare page. So here's the Budgery Guard at Duck One Duck Pond Lane and he's got a fence and some flowers and I put one of those um, things I got. It's a, a letter or a, something on a piece of vellum. It's cool. Then this is my favourite page, just one of my favourite pages, they're all my favourite pages, I really love this page, isn't it good? <laughs> and then I put in here a booklet which refuses to lay down flat, I've had that clip down all night, I've had it under something and it won't stay flat, so I'm sorry about that because that's actually a decoupage napkin on there and it just wants to curl up on me, I've tried and tried and tried, but if we keep it down in there it might settle down a bit so therefore there's a lot of journaling space in that little booklet there you can't actually write in your book you can write behind him though and then there's more pages here which I've left the inside here blank so I do that a fair bit I think now this one here um, I had a little bit of trouble didn't like the way it was going but I thought I'd leave it because it's not too bad I don't think it looks too bad you unpull this, all right, I'm not going to do that because I'm going to die back up. I fastened it under the ticket and I fastened it under the back and on the inside there there's journaling space for that because it's a little flip out thing. There's a stamp from our home to yours and there's a Peter Rabbit. I wanted to put Peter Rabbit and there's a, a tuck spot and there's two pieces of bits in there. There's one with a little fairy on it and that bit there which you can do with whatever you want to do. Then there's this piece here that you would have seen before and I can't undo it because everything's going to have to be done back up but as it is I'm going to have to go through and check everything because they've got a little loose bead there, look. Actually I might have sewed that, did I? I was going to sew it. I might, I might have sewed it so it might not be loose, it might be just hanging. I'll have to go check on that. So I've got a few things to check. I love this pocket here that I made with the leaves. Works really well. So you've got something substantial on the bottom here, like this little envelope, which I have, and I don't know if there's anything in there, you'll have to have a peep to see if you get it the book, <laughs> see what's in it. I may show it again when I've finished, before I put it up. So there's a um, piece of fabric, I love these bits of bling, I don't know what I've done with them, So I, and I love this little um, kookaburra, how he worked out with that bits and pieces, and there's another blank page with a piece of fabric. These things here I've been doing this morning, I've made this cluster and there's actually a pocket, that one, and that one's just for, for the for the look. This one here has a paper clip because I couldn't figure out how to close it. And it just opens up like that and goes, and that's made out of a piece of, um, you just, you just tip, tip it over those two. That's made out of a piece of um, writing paper that had a really nice pictures on it. And then we got this one, now this is the one that I made and I haven't put anything in there yet either, have I? I'll have to put some... I'll have to go and find something to put in there. Um, this is a bit I made that day and I actually put that piece on and then I found this bit today and thought, well, I'll put it on there too and you can just use that for a tuck. Now, I made this this morning. <laughs> this is a lot of fun, I'm sort of. Okay, so these all come out, as you would do and then you've got it like that, okay? And so then you can either decorate or write on any of these bits and I've put a piece of um, plain paper through there so you can see that it's um, divided pockets and butterfly. And then there's this one here that we did, <coughs> you would have seen this the day before you see this one, is where I did um, this hidden thingy. Isn't it cool? Amy, who is Al John, made one of those, and I didn't see her make it. I seen a shot to us. I missed one when she made it because I didn't. But if you do that, oh well, I've got the video on how I did it yesterday or before this one. Another page, a little bit of uh, um, bits and pieces there, a bit of collaging or whatever, 
little pretty um, flowers with faces and there's another one of these books that refuses to close so it's gone in the belly band <laughs> maybe one day it will close and the little heart and there's, there's an empty space now I don't know if I showed you this one I might have done I think I did that too on the video I don't know but anyway that's that and I don't know why I stuck that there I'm going to move it he's not drying and this one here is another one of those isn't it cool I love them I loved every I like everything on this page so I didn't want to cover any of it up so I put a little thing there there's a bird and there's some little ducks and there's some rabbits what else was on there oh that's all oh butterfly is there another something anyway I tried to make it so at the tiny little baby ducks I tried to make it so it was all still on the page and there's the last one and I accidentally found this look at this it's a this book belongs to and it's got an owl on it and I thought if anybody buys this they might like to put that on here somewhere and put their name on it so I'm just going to leave that somewhere here because these are just the back pockets with all the and lots of journaling space on there and there's and the bits of free you know the bits of fluff <laughs> anyway so that's one that I'm going to be putting into my Etsy <clears throat> and um, not yet I want to do the cover so that I'll, it'll be a little while I've got a few other things that I will video that I'm going to put up too uh, I don't I'm sorry if you think I'm whinging but I did not even sleep last night so I'm sorry I can't do anything to <laughs> I don't know if I might, what I made today is any good because I, did, I just didn't get any sleep at all. So I don't know what happened, but I didn't. Well, maybe I do. You know, I was. I had the music going loud in my headphones. <laughs> I was listening to music and uh, sort of jive around on the chair for a few for a little while and sort of enjoy myself, you know. And I just. Um, and then I couldn't sleep. I could not go to sleep. So there's no more. Jeremy said no more music for me. <laughs> oh dear, I found some really. I love um, I love country, uh, you know, like country music and uh, oh, lots of different things. Footloose and things like that. I love listen to those things and rockabilly ones and you know, things from my age. My mother had music going all the time when we were kids, and if she wasn't home, we had ours on. So. It was just, you know, my uncles always had music playing and it was just a thing, but I so, sort of did a bit, but me, Jeremy and I have a different taste in music completely, completely, although I do mind, I don't mind some of what he likes, but we sort of not, so I listen to mine under my headphones and he just has his going if he plays any, but anyway, so thank you everybody for watching and I hope you're all having a good day and staying safe. And it's going to start getting hot here now, so we're going to have to start getting ourselves cooled down a bit. <laughs> um, we've got the coolers ready. I'm going to have to get one in this window. He's got a, he's getting the stuff to put that in, so I'll have it going. And then when I get do my videos, I'll have to turn it off while I tape. Okay? So thank you, everybody, for watching. And um, thank you so much to all my new subscribers and my older subscribers. Thank you so much for your lovely comments. And... I can't remember some of them because I'm, I'm too tired, sorry. <laughs> I can't remember my, my comments. I don't know if anybody wanted to know anything, but if you do, just ask me and I'll try and put it up in the next video. Okay? You probably should see this one on Monday. By then, hopefully I've had a sleep because this is Sunday morning-ish. Okay? Thank you, everybody, for watching, and I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.